A warm welcome to Africa Social TV, that is the business here, and we're all about entertainment, therefore click subscribe. Now, I know most of you look at your stars and uh, sometimes they go on to uh, doing collabs, and when they do those collabs, the songs really come out nice, but the fans still yearn for more to the extent from uh, asking for more singles and asking uh, for more albums. Now, right now, we are gonna give you, I'm gonna give you some five albums, five Nigerian albums that uh, I mean you would want to obviously hear, or those artists that you would want to see onto an album together. Just imagine uh, the likes of Olamide, Wizke, Davido, uh, and they go away from just making collabs or singles to making an album together. How rich will they be? Oh, how viral will that album go? Now, straight up, we start with the king and uh, the official queen of African music. And this is none other than Wizkid and uh, Tiwa Savage. Now, have you ever imagined these two not just doing a single, but just doing an album together? Now, you already know the duo have worked together on several singles in the past, including the likes of Malo, uh, of Tour Savage's uh, Sugarcane EP, then there was Bad, which made it onto the deluxe edition of her R.E.D. album, or Red album. Now, one thing for sure is that we cannot be denied, or they cannot be denied, the fact that there is a chemistry working for them as they could complement each other quite well and make hit songs every time they combine. Now, uh, Whiskey to a Savage, uh, the closest artist on the continent uh, that fit the profile of uh, the American uh, rapper Jay Z and maybe uh, Beyonce. I'm telling you, this pair, if it got onto an album, everything will just go into the clouds right now just like jay-z and uh jay's just like jay-z and beyonce have already dropped uh, uh a song that is uh, called uh, everything is love uh this could be a similar project we are imagining that with kid and tiwa savage could do something similar and it could help address the speculation surrounding the relationships now straight up we go to none other than the lady with a very sweet voice and the guy with a unique sound that is uh, Simi and uh, Dekune Gold. Now, back in 2016, Simi uh, teamed up with Brapa Fowles, the bad guy, uh, on uh, a collaborative uh, EP called Chemistry, which was well received in the ears of Nigerians and Africa at large, and it's spawned of uh, hit songs. Now, but the joint project that could really bang our ears and give us the ear uh the eargasm is simi alongside adekune gold now outside their rumored relationship the duo have also created magic working together now simi was only featured artist on now uh, adekune's uh, debut album which was gold while her voice was obviously heavily visible uh on his uh so formal project which is about 30 uh which was uh, which is also doing well uh on the billboard as well now simi's smooth voice blends with uh, adekune gold and are following the success of their latest individual albums this collaborative project might just be one on the right side right so why don't we go straight to who, who which other uh which other artists could uh, could do a very good uh, collabo here we are talking Mr. Wande Cole and uh, Wizkid Balagan still. As you can see, he's still surfacing because uh, he's a very versatile artist when it comes to music. Now, this has long since been rumored and it's a high time this is delivered uh, for the African culture, of course. First mentioned during a radio uh, interview back in 2014, Wizkid announced that he was working with Wande Cole on a joint album. Then in 2017, the prior release of his sounds from on the other side EP, Wizkid again stated that he was working on four projects that included a collaborative effort with one they call now these two have heavy voices and one they call you know is such a talented guy now this 2018 and even though the two are just besties who have collaborated on our whiskey superstar album which was released back in 2011 2010 and i've shared the same stage uh at several concerts the project is yet to materialize and armed with obviously a huge uh, uh success with solo careers it is mouth-watering uh, I mean, as for us imagining what their joint album would sound like. Now, the other pair here 
is uh, that is techno miles or haji techno and uh, mr obio that is uh, davido now these two have quite a history of working together uh, on and off records yeah in 2014 the pair first worked together on these songs uh, that is holiday then in 2017 they came together uh, and worked with uh, Chris Bates uh, with a certain single that I'm trying to remember here that is a rumor uh, but the biggest result of their partnership was uh, the surface on Davido's Eve which was produced by Tekken and that was a blockbuster now it will also be recalled that during the time of Davido's beef with WizKid Tekken was one of those who openly showed support for DMW boss, which in a way is a signal to the strength of their friendship that could lead to obviously an album together. Now, the other pair here is uh, one that would actually work for Africa and the world. That is uh, Olamide and still Whiskey. We are seeing Whiskey surfacing the third time. You understand? So, which is very great talent here when they first collaborated on omo to shine in 2011 it was just another coming together of two young hungry and budding artists now remember this 2018 the africana all i mean and whiskey put together their individual star powers just to deliver a song that is gradually turning into a street anthem and a fan's favorite now these two talented acts with a fairly similar story of rising to fame and uh, with both known for always crafting new music new slangs and embracing new territories why not a joint album for the acclaimed king of nigerian rap and the star boy right here now music is such a strong a stronger kind of bond yeah if an artist does not find a connection with the other artist which means uh these things couldn't really uh bring up the gist the buzz around the song and the arts the collective effort yeah an artist needs to connect to the other artist just to make a blockbuster single or a blockbuster album just give it an imagination right here for those stars to just have albums but not just singles what would music be like right someone would be like you know what uh maybe an, an artist would have to put uh, the individual work aside and uh, base on an album or put all the effort on the album right i'm thinking uh, africa would even grow larger better wider huge in this music industry and will give the rest of the world a certain competition that would even never imagine my name is dennis the business thanks for watching click subscribe it's africa social tv and we speak entertainment. I'll be right back in a GV.